morning beautiful people welcome back to my channel so i just got up just made my bed it is currently eight o'clock in the morning and i am going to do fasted cardio so i've been doing this for the last three days now it's been three days in a row and i'm on a roll with it so i'm gonna keep doing it because i'm trying to shred and tone so we're gonna make this little series we're gonna have some fun we're gonna get fit for summer and even though it already is summer, but whatever. <laughs> so I'm gonna take you guys through like a little day in my life of like this little shred series and um, just show you guys like what I do. It's not too restrictive. All I'm pretty much doing is just increasing the amount of cardio that I'm doing and cleaning up my diet. And I'll explain that later after breakfast because I'm starving and I need to get this cardio done. So I will see you guys at the sprints. Okay, so I literally cannot see anything out here. <laughs> Right now the sun is literally my face um so basically what we're gonna be doing is 10 rounds there and back is one and i'll have 20 seconds rest in between because we want to do it as fast as possible with little rest because that's when it's most effective but i'm gonna be going from this line right here to down there you guys will see where i um run down to and there and back like i said is one so i'm doing that 10 times 20 seconds rest in between well let's go ahead and get started because i can't see anything <laughs> There's an energy when you hold me, when you touch me, it's so powerful, I can feel it, when you hold me, when you touch One eternity later. I'm dead. I'm so out of shape, you guys. It's another reason why I wanted to start doing these things, because I look like I'm in shape, but I'm not, and I used to be collegiate level tennis player and very in shape so it's definitely my goal with this whole little cut is just to increase my stamina because <laughs> I'm dead RIP all right guys give that a try it's brutal feels great and I'm dead okay so I just got home I'm literally so pale <laughs> look at my face I'm dead that was so tough but honestly I feel amazing now so definitely worth it so I'm gonna go inside I'm gonna drink my celery juice that I already made this morning so I could go ahead and drink it right when I got home and you're supposed to drink it on an empty stomach and then wait 20 minutes before you drink or eat anything else and then I'm gonna make a smoothie I'm gonna show you guys what I put in my smoothie it's amazing it's literally everything in my kitchen <laughs> and more but it's so good and I love smoothies because you can literally put anything in it and make it so healthy so I'm gonna drink my smoothie and then I'm running late I have to drop my car off to get an oil change so I'm gonna do that and just drink my smoothie on the go and then when I get back I'll make like a little snack so some makeup on so I can be more presentable for you guys so here I am who is she <laughs> um, but I just wanted to explain to you guys why I'm doing this little cut and basically I've been doing the same thing for probably the last two years I've just been working out I haven't been doing cardio I've just been intuitively eating pretty much whatever I want with some exceptions um, I am dairy free and gluten free for the most part but I was kind of like slack on the gluten um, so Basically this like diet I guess that I'm going to be doing it's not restrictive at all I'm just going to be like cleaning up my diet if that makes sense Like going hardcore gluten-free hardcore dairy-free and just really eating clean like that's my goal just because I would count my macros, but honestly, I just feel like it's not necessary. I mean, just for my personal preference. And I think that it can be done just by cleaning up your diet. So that's basically what I'm going to be doing. And I'll show you guys, like, everything. Honestly, I think that's so important for a healthy lifestyle 
it's just to have like a good balance of like eating clean and working out like really effectively so basically that's what i'm doing i just wanted to switch things up a little bit and i do want to tone my stomach a little more just because i feel like it has more potential and that's just something i want to see change in so i'm going to do a little physique update for you guys as well in a second before we go and eat lunch as far as my workout goes I have been doing two a days and I mentioned this on my Instagram story and I just want to clear it up because some people were confused. So I've been doing two workouts in one day. So in the morning, I go and do sprints and it's very quick. It's very effective. I'm not spending a lot of time there either on the treadmill, wherever you want to do it, where you can go outside, you can go out in your driveway and do it, whatever it is sprints like maximum for like 20 minutes like it should be something you're not spending a lot of time on even like 10 minutes um so i've been doing workouts in the morning cardio and then later on in the evening i do weights so that's like a slower paced workout and that's like my normal routine weight workout and i know a lot of you guys may not have time to do two workouts in one day if you don't do whatever works for best for you. So if you need to do your cardio before your main session, like if you're at the gym and you need to do cardio for 10 minute sprints, like in the gym, that's fine. Do whatever you need to do for yourself. I do have time in the morning. I wake up earlier and I go do sprints and I make it happen for myself because that's what I want to do. But make sure it fits your schedule and you're doing whatever works best for you. Yeah, that's basically it. Um, I feel like I've been talking forever and I want to show you guys my physique update. So let's go ahead and do that now and then we'll go eat lunch. Jump on here really quick. Um, I feel like a lot of people expect or assume that like fitness influencers, especially a lot of people on Instagram, have like no bloating or their bodies are just absolutely perfect at all times of the day. Wrong. Okay, this is me flex, right? Yeah, looks great. You know, still have a little belly down there. And this is me relaxed. So yeah, this is real. This is real life, okay? Yep, look at her. She looks great, honestly. So don't ever think that you are alone and that you're the only one that has bloating or inflammation or just a lower belly because we all do, especially women. We naturally carry a lot of our body fat in this region right here. So just embrace it, love yourself, clean up your diet. That's a huge thing is definitely cleaning it up because I feel like a lot of this is inflammation. Um, so that's like basically my goal with my little cleanse slash cut is just to kind of cut this down right here but yeah this is where i'm at this is my body it's got these little affirmation cards they're the life love you cards from louise and robert holden and i want to pull one for you guys i'll pull the top one because i always do one each day i'll do this one today for you guys and i love these cards they're so cute so this one says, I am worthy of my own love. Write a love note to yourself. What is it that you most need or want to hear? And I've actually done this before. I've written myself a love note and just basically like talk to myself as if like someone that really loved me was to write to me and say those things. And it actually is very, very powerful. And I love that this one actually <laughs> is the one I picked because I think that everyone deserves to do this for themselves because it really is so powerful. So do this, and if you do, let me know how it goes. My favorite to make because you can literally eat a whole bowl and not feel like crap about it and it's super healthy you don't bloat after it and it just it feels good to eat it because you're eating so many veggies um but yeah this is a salad that i make a lot because it's what i know and what i love and if i don't love a salad i won't eat it normally so i definitely have to make a salad like how i like it so i will list this recipe down below in the description box for you guys if you're interested in making it how i make it but there are tons of recipes on pinterest 
to make it however you want. And honestly, the cauliflower rice was the first time I've done that and it was such a good, oh my God, I'm gonna get blown away. I forgot what I was saying. I think I was talking about the cauliflower rice. Um, I literally heated it up on the stove for like five minutes maybe and then threw it in my salad and it was so good. So you guys have to try that if you haven't tried it. It's just like different to throw into a salad. Um, and then this is my dressing that I always use. It's organic bill. It's organic and gluten-free, and it's just an olive oil and balsamic vinaigrette that I use. Um, but yeah, so that's basically my lunch for the day. I'm probably going to snack. I will let you guys know if I do. Um, I might make a protein shake later. I'll probably head to the gym. So I'm going to go downstairs, do some editing and more work, and I'm going to finish my apples, and then I will catch up with you guys later. So I'm heading out to run some errands and I grabbed this Made Good Mixed Berry Granola Minis and they're so cute. They're literally so tiny. It's honestly a perfect little snack. So I grabbed these. I got them from Costco and they come in a much larger pack of them. And then I grabbed the Arbonne Fist Stick in Strawberry and then a Mind to Health in the Cherry Lime flavor. And I love combining these two. I just throw them in a glass of 10 ounces of water and shake it up and drink it. And I've been doing this for a while. I'm obsessed with Arbonne, you guys. So I'll link these below, but basically the fizz stick is good for energy without the jitteriness and it's made from green tea and vitamin B. And then the mind health just helps with focus, concentration, and memory and also contains B12, lowers your cholesterol, and it is vegan and gluten-free. So like I said, I'm just going to combine these and throw them in there, drink that, and then eat a little snack. Okay, so Jamie and I are heading to the gym for round two. I have a banana in my water bottle. And I'm not going to show my whole workout. I'll probably record it and post it as like a full workout on YouTube. So I'm not going to show the whole thing. You guys saw my hit this morning. But yeah, we're going to go get a workout in and then dinner. So Jamie and I just got back from the gym. Say hi. Hello. And I am sipping on a protein shake before we make some dinner. Um, I just put some water, a little bit of almond milk, and then protein in it. So I'm going to sip on this. And then we'll start making dinner. This is my meal. I made lots of veggies. I did some squash, cauliflower, and broccoli and just roasted it with some garlic. And then I did half of the salmon and then a little bit of rice. And that's it. My best friend came over to see me and to play with my hair. Kate! Best friend as in Kate. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, look how cute my hair looks. Okay, let me give them a back. Yes, let me give them a front. Look how cute. I'm obsessed. Look at the back of it. So this is the back. Um, as you can see. <laughs> oh shit. Look how good it looks. Look at how good. I'm obsessed. If anyone needs their hair done, call Kate. Call Kate. No, I'm just kidding. Call Allie. It's National Smile Day. Oh my god, I love it. Thank you. You're welcome. Anyone lives in the Charleston area? Um, She's moving to Charleston, South Carolina, so she okay, will be there. Did you say the Atlanta area? Yeah. I mean, but you, I mean, I you'll do. be back and forth yeah. a little bit, so. Yeah, she's amazing. But she's definitely so Charleston, at Allie Wheeler Hair. Follow me or I'll find you. <laughs> He's so cute. Look at him. He's just a little baby. He He's just a little baby. Right now. All right, guys, so I'm going to go ahead and end this video here because me and Allie are going to hang out. I haven't seen her in forever. And I love her. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video, this little cut series I'm gonna be doing. And if you guys wanna see more videos like this while I'm on my little cut cleanse diet thing that I'm doing, <laughs> let me know, comment down below, and don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you liked it, and to subscribe so you never miss another video. And I love you guys so much. I will see you in the next one.